Apple gadgets are a part of daily life for many of us and we all know that Apple has some of the best minds in the tech industry that work on these devices and challenge themselves to produce the best tech that eventually becomes part of our daily life. And one of them is the Apple Watch. Welcome back. In today's video, we'll be telling you about some of the features that Apple has patented and planned to introduce in the future gadgets. And being one of the Android users, I think Apple is working on creating something better. So let's see which features were missing in the Android gadgets that Apple will be capitalizing on in the future. Apple is rumored to have a team of biomedical engineers working on a method for non-invasively monitoring blood glucose levels using optical sensors. This is a technology that could potentially make its way into the Apple Watch at some point in the future. Such a feature would make diabetes management much easier because it would not require puncturing the skin. Blood glucose monitoring has been a feature that Apple has been working on for years. Based on rumors, however, it is a serious health feature that would require regulation. My sources have claimed that Apple is working on short wavelength infrared sensors, which could allow the Apple Watch Series 8 to monitor blood glucose by measuring the amount of sugar in the blood. Unfortunately, my sources aren't that reliable. And Bloomberg says that blood glucose monitoring is still many years away. Non-invasive blood sugar monitoring is a feature that is several years away and doesn't have a target launch year as of yet. In the meantime, Apple could add improved support for third-party glucose monitors. Next one, blood pressure measurement. Now the blood pressure monitoring technology won't be ready until 2024 at the earliest and a launch could slip to 2025 as well. Apple is working on an updated sensor and accompanying software that could be able to detect higher blood pressure, but in testing, it has not been accurate. Apple is testing blood pressure monitoring with employees. The feature will not provide systolic and diastolic readings, will warn Apple Watch users that they may have hypertension that could be investigated further. Apple supplier Rockley Photonics is working on an advanced digital sensor that will allow wearable devices to monitor biomarkers like core body temperature, blood pressure, body hydration, alcohol lactate, glucose strengths, and more using optical sensors. This technology could eventually make its way to the Apple Watch given the partnership between Apple and Rockley. And rumors suggest that we will see the blood pressure monitoring capabilities introduced at some point. Next up is the satellite connectivity. In the future, Apple plans to bring satellite connectivity to the Apple Watch and will allow for emergency texting and SOS response features right on the wrist. Satellite connectivity is coming to the iPhone 14 and later and it will expand to Apple Watch as Elon did it so Apple can do it as well. Now about the Touch ID. A 2020 pair of patents suggests Apple is researching Touch ID and an under-display camera for the Apple Watch. Apple describes a side button with an integrated Touch ID fingerprint sensor that can be used for identification and device unlocking. Currently, the Apple Watch unlocks with a passcode and also when the paired iPhone is unlocked. As for an under-camera display, the patent describes two-stage display technology that includes camera that is externally visible only when engaged. In 2021, Apple outlined a radical redesign of the Apple Watch in a patent filing, featuring a round watch face, wraparound flexible display, and digitally customizable watch bands. Now, Apple has patented several interesting technologies that could potentially be used in future Apple Watch devices. One of such technologies being biometric authentication feature that gives device identity access based on the wearer's skin pattern. Such a feature would eliminate the need of a passcode when wearing the Apple Watch. Another patent describes a self Another patent describes a self-tightening Apple Watch band that would be able to adjust itself during intensive activities like running or working out for accurate heart rate readings and loosen up afterwards. The tightening could be used for direction, workout reps and much more. There's another patent that describes an Apple Watch band with an LED indicator that would visualize the progress of an activity or a task, providing a visual indicator when completing a workout or an activity ring, for example. There's also something on Parkinson patient monitoring. 
Apple in December 2019 published a patent describing how the Apple Watch would have the doctors monitor the symptoms of Parkinson's patient using sensors to keep a track of tremors. Apple believes this method of data tracking would allow users to better track their symptoms so that they can plan activities around symptom patterns. So there are also rumors that uh, Apple would make an active band something like Samsung has already done. Apple has filed several other patents covering the possibility of moving hardware into Apple's watch band including batteries, speakers, kinetic power generators, haptic feedback devices and even cameras. There's no word on whether these patent features will make it into an actual Apple Watch future but it's interesting to see what is Apple actually working on and considering behind the scenes. That's great Apple to bring in all these features but the main thing uh, that they need to work on is the battery life because you for using all these features they will need a lot of power and so far the battery isn't providing any power that is lasting more than a few hours. Hope you like this video. To watch more like these in the future, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. So until next video, stay safe and goodbye.